Hello and welcome to this video on reading a flipped video. Now, the reason we're doing this flipped video thing is so that we can clear more uh, space and time in class for the more interesting stuff. So you're going to be watching these videos on your own and taking notes on them, and that's going to allow us to do games and more fun activities in class and do less just straight reading. Um, and we're going to do interesting reading in a way that's going to challenge you but will be worthwhile. So that's the goal here. Here's the basics on how this all works. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to TeacherTube and search for Dolson, or YouTube and search for Mr. Dolson, because that's how you're going to find me those two places. You're going to want to make an account for yourself, because that way you can subscribe to my channels and you'll always get notified when I put up a new video. Uh, you want to find the playlist for your class, either World History or World Geography, depending on which class of mine you're in, and then you'll watch the video that you've been assigned that day with headphones, and then you take notes. Make sure you're listening to the headphones because when you're taking notes, you'll have guided notes and you should read the slide, but you should also listen to what I say because sometimes, dot, 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 there's an extra period there, uh, sometimes things that I say are not on the slides. Sometimes there are pictures that I am explaining which you should make note of in your notes. But if you miss what I'm saying, then you can pause and rewind, and then you should read over what you wrote once you've actually taken all these notes and you've watched through the video, because then you're going to log it away in your brain, make sure you understand what it is that you've written and what I've written on your notes, um, and then answer any questions you find, because sometimes these sets of notes will have guiding questions, so once you've taken some notes, uh, to respond to them. So once you've done that, you finish these notes. Speaking of which... Now, you should have finished your notes.